Jordan Spieth may be from Dallas, but professionally he's had more success in Fort Worth at Colonial, and that's where Spieth and the PGA Tour stopped this week. Keith Russell is live at Colonial Country Club, the site of the Fort Worth Invitational. Keith? Hey, Gilma. In the last three years here at Colonial, he's gone runner-up, winner, runner-up. You know, most people think Jordan Spieth has the world in the palm of his hands, and he does. But today he shared the not so glamorous side of things, the pressures, the stressors, and what has allowed him to keep moving forward. For this two week stretch, DFW gets to rally around one of its own. We get a shot to see with our own eyes Jordan Spieth, one year older, one year wiser. But it also reminds us that most of his journey we don't get to see. I've just had a lot of, I've had experiences that a lot of guys have over the course of 25 years within three years, um, ups and downs and everything in between. Despite being consistently on golf's biggest stage, Spieth opened up about the aspect of that which makes him vulnerable. Learning to kind of live life in the spotlight and what that entails and you know what to block out, what to embrace, um, it's still a learning experience. Perfect. A missed a stretch where he's earned some of the game's biggest wins, but also suffered some of the most heartbreaking defeats. There's one lesson at age 24 he promises to hang on to for the rest of his life. The highs are too high from the outside, and the lows are too low from the outside from my real experience of them. So um, trying to trying to stay pretty neutral and, and just look at the big picture things and try and wake up every single day loving what I do. Not too long ago, that wasn't the case. I loathe going to the golf course for a little while, and I'm, um, I'm certainly not there now. I'm... Coming up tonight at 6, the make or break moment in the career for Jordan Spieth. What had him so down in the dumps? What has allowed him to rise again? Live at the Fort Worth Invitational, Keith Russell, CBS 11 Sports.